I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. College and Career Center, Halloween costume contest, peer leader shirts, and more. Today is Wednesday, November 1st. And you're watching HMG, HMG News. News. I'm Avalon Martinez, and here are your morning announcements. Would you like to support NWCTA peer, peer, peer leaders and our students? If you would, please order one of our new peer leader shirts in any color. On the back, of, add your last name and any number. Today is the last day to order any jerseys. Scan the QR code on the screen to order your shirt. We'll be right back after this break. The Bash Bandit. Is this a big bad baggy mad big bad big 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 bad bandit badge? The what? Ugh, it's a good thing I was wearing my badge. Wait, badge. No more. No more. Where's your badge? You should have been wearing it at all times. Like I did. In all seriousness, Hawks, make sure to wear your IDs visible at all times. Stay safe out there. See you around. Sure am. Why did the mushroom get invited to all the best parties? I don't know. Why? Because he's a fun guy. Get it? Because, you know, fungus? And Moving on. Okay. The Halloween poll went up to see who had the best Halloween costume. Really? Who won? We don't know yet, but we should know soon. Hmm. I bet you're going to win. You have the best Halloween costume. Yeah, flappers are so classy. Mm. Speaking of classy, Emily is here to tell us about the College and Career Center. Hey Hawks, it's Emily Sanchez from HMG News and today we're going to be talking about college visits. So the college visits do quite a few things. First of all, the representatives from the universities that come are the ones who are reading your um, applications. So they're the ones who admit you. So you can ask them questions like, what stands out in an application? Do you have free fly-ups where you can fly people out to your university so that they can check it out? Do you have a fee waiver? and they'll give you fee waivers. For example, um, Oregon Tech came today and they gave all the people who came a fee waiver. I wrote it down, so if you want it, see me in 806. But if you're interested in those, they give you those waivers so you can apply for free, so that you can get information about the school and you can potentially um, see exactly what they want in their applications. The college visits allow students to ask colleges questions that they may have not had the opportunity to do beforehand. This can help students choose what college that they would like to attend to. It's very easy to set up an appointment for a college visit. I've sent it to every single teacher, so it should be posted in Canvas announcements in every single class that you're in. It's also posted to the CTE classroom, but if you happen to be walking by 806, you can sign up right here on our rep visits. We have a QR code and you can scan and sign up. We also have a list of everybody who's coming and when they're coming. If for whatever reason you accidentally missed the, uh, the rep visit, we have all the pamphlets from anybody who has visited so that you can get that information. You can also see me and I can get you in contact directly with that representative as well. Thank you for that, Ms. Chamberlain. I'm Emily Sanchez from HMG News and back to the studio. That was very good information on our future colleges. I don't know about you, but I'm very excited about my future college. And on that note, thank you so much for watching this edition of HMG News. Make sure to follow us on Instagram at hawkmediagroup.news. And follow us on Twitch at HMG underscore Twitch. You can also catch up on previous episodes on our YouTube at HMG News. I'm Lucia. I'm Avalon Martinez. Have, Have a, a great, great day, day, Hawks. Hawks.